All right, there we go. There's my crabby sarcasm for the day. We are now four. We are now four wins in a row. Rock A, Crystal B, Zolt, A, Fed A. Let's let's be crabby and sarcastic about FTL now. So let's see what our next random ship is. Random ship in three, two, one, and random. Uh, rock C, we have not done. Let's do it. Uh, I don't think I have any rock requests I haven't done. I got Brass Monkey on last time. It's mostly Mantis. Mantis ship Mantis that people are requesting. And Stealth stealth and Stealth Beast crew, I guess. Any rock or crystal requests that I see? I do not see any outstanding rock or crystal crew requests, I don't think. Okay. Uh, Rand getting this all out before the run starts. Yeah, if only it worked that way. If only. Ouch, yeah, it was, it was pretty rough. It's pretty rough. Spending an extra 300 and something bucks, you're not planning on it because your apartment complex sucks. It's not a fun time. Organize and become an HOA and then let your reign start. There you go. Thank you for the 42 bits, BJA. Appreciate that. Thank you again to, uh, who was it earlier? Uh... It was T-Bone Jenks <laughs> donated a hundred bucks to help my life feel a little less bad about that. I really appreciate that. Uh, first jump, sell rock hole plating, get shield upgrade. Seems pretty decent. Yeah. Every Mantis request secretly a request for Rand to play grounded. <laughs> All right, Tyler, sure. <laughs> Um, do I care about weapon upgrade, like buying a charge laser? Is it worth selling Swarm to get charge laser? <laughs> there are towing scams that get busted all the time. Well, this wasn't actually a scam because, I mean, I was able to get my car. Everything worked correctly. I, I actually did park in a restricted place. The problem is the places that are reserved at my apartment complex I can't even get one because there's a waiting list because the parking sucks so bad. So I've been at my apartment complex for a year and I'm now on the waiting list for a reserved parking space so that I don't get towed at my own goddamn apartment complex. So, if you don't like it yourself, the downgrade until ships with two shields turn out. Yeah, but we want to replace the swarm eventually, right? That probably is worse. And this is the curse missile, which... A little annoying. I should probably just get the shield value, though. You really don't need to upgrade weapons to start on this ship, so let's just go for shields, even though I prefer to get a weapon that doesn't use missiles. And I'm sure there are towing scams. I'm pretty sure what I got caught by or hit by was not a towing scam. What the heck? At your spot, you gotta pay for the roof over the car and they reserved it, yeah. Yeah, I don't even know, I'm on the waiting list for the, um, for the reserve spot now, and I don't even know how much it is if I get it. But to me, it's just stupid that I pay $1,500 a month for rent and I don't even have a reserved parking space. What the, what the F is that? Seriously, I pay goddamn rent. I should have a goddamn reserve space at my own goddamn apartment complex. It's so dumb. It's not the cursed missile, it is the cursed missile. That's right. So we can get second shield. Excuse my language, but I'm I'm not very happy about my apartment complex right now. Alright, um one extra jump does get me eleven. The problem is I have to get here before seven, and it's the exit is gate kept by the jump that gets me extra jumps, so it's kind of worthless. So I guess I just get here in seven, eight, nine, and I miss out on two extra jumps. So here in seven. Oh gosh, there's not even. I have to backtrack through this too. What a shitty sector one. Jesus. All right, this is a really terrible sector one layout. You had your own garage for that much. For $1,500? Uh, that was eight years ago. In cities where providing a parking spot is required, rent, rent tends to be a lot higher. Rent should pay rent because it's unfair. 
Oh, as soon as I got my shields, guess what? Free shield hack with a fucking auto hacker on my fucking weapon hack. Fuck you, FTL. Oh, I hate this goddamn game. This is a shield hack plus a fucking weapon hack in the same jump. Fuck you, FTL. Okay, we get that down at least. Kill the hacking. Fuck you, FTL. And that, that on, shot man. misses. These fucking dodges. Level 3 weapons, free shield hack, plus a fucking weapon hack. F this shitty game. This might be the worst event in the game. Shield hack event absolutely should not be able to generate an auto hacker as well. Yeah, it's fucking stupid. You need to be a good dog. You need to stop friends. being a bad uh, dog. Genius idea. Since you're going to start renting one of the rooms in your house in a few months, you should charge extra to let them park in front of your house. Well, if you want to be a douchebag landlord, like uh, apparently my park parking complex, go for it. Go for it. There you go. That's why it's called the swear missile or the curse missile or whatever we're calling it. What's that, Muhammad? Alright, uh, let me get one power so I can have everything online without me taking power to book two. Now we save for hacking or a weapon upgrade. Landlord and douchebag are synonymous terms. Mm, probably so. Alright, safe fight. This is something we didn't get a single time last run. A fight where I could actually... Praying. But I have to uh, have to deal with the boarding first before I turn on the speed hack, though. And then we can crew kill afterwards, potentially. Alright, he's gonna board a second time. Then we want to kill the second time boarder. And then we train, and then we crew kill, hopefully, is the plan. Do you believe that you're a really good landlord, Burger? You're, you're the only one. I actually have a um, a friend that I sing with who I think is also a landlord. And when you when you talk to landlords, the thing that they always complain about is how um, property taxes are going up every year, so they have to keep raising rent. That's what landlords complain about, from what I've heard. Although I'm pretty sure Burger said he hasn't raised rent in a long time, so Burger might actually be one of the few good landlords in the world. A few nice ones that doesn't raise rent every year. Okay. You rent a place to someone you'd like to think you're not a monster. Car tow, did you park at that downtown Dallas spot that is YouTube famous for towing? No, I know what you're talking about though. That place is so famous that when I went down to Dallas for jury duty, ju jury duty the people in the jury duty um, intro told them that if they parked there they should move their car because they could they could get towed for the scam that it is. So it wasn't that. It was at my own apartment, which might even be worse. Tar t towed from my own apartment because I chose the wrong place to park because my apartment complex doesn't have enough parking for the people who actually live in the apartment. Um, it's not just property taxes, other stuff too. Oh, I'm sure there's a thousand things you have to pay for when you're a landlord. <clears throat> I'm gonna cross train everything here. Did I update the street count? I did, it should be at four. You might have to refresh though. Property tax going up, you pay like 600 a month of property tax alone on your house. You were landlord at one time. Next time take a screwdriver and take off the sign, then you can park there. You haven't started renting yet, so you can't raise rent to compensate. HOA fee at the condo complex where I own a rental unit went from 270 to 460 in two years. Yeah, honestly, in Dallas, it's hard for me even to blame landlords for the rent going up because 
like I know a lady who sells houses. I know I I know people who rent out places, and like the prices are just skyrocketing because people keep moving to Dallas. Basically, people need to stop moving to Dallas so my rent stops going higher. But I just need to leave Dallas. Really is what it is. I just need to not live in overpriced, overhyped, overcrowded, over moved to Dallas, Texas. All right, let's see how our training's going here. Decently well. Dallas is so car-centric, so the city is like a huge parking lot. You can't walk anywhere because it's so hot. Yeah. And you didn't even mention that Dallas is possibly the worst uh, public transit city in Texas. Maybe in the U.S., I don't know. Of the large cities in Texas, I've lived in Houston and Dallas. I never tried the public transit in Houston, so I don't know if it's worse or not. But having used the Dallas public transit a couple times, I can tell you all it's ridiculously bad. All right, what do we got here? All right, we fully train pretty quickly. Basically, living sucks. <laughs> TLDR, living sucks. We all vent ourselves as humans. What makes it bad? The mass transit? Um, because everything in DFW is spread out. Whatever city you live in, um, the square mileage of DFW is probably double to triple or more than your city would be my guess because DFW is just so spread out and um, the places that do have trains tr uh, train stops are few and far between and basically only go to downtown Dallas so it doesn't cover enough area it um is slow. Let's do it this way. Use one missile to get two kill. Ow! Ow! Oh, come oh. on! Game. And probably come something on. else I can't think of. Yeah, DFW, is ter Df DFW has terrible public transit, and despite that, is probably top 10 public transit in America. Which is really sad if that's true. I, I have a hard time believing that, but I guess that might actually be true with how bad public transit is in America in general. Being from continental Europe and having been to several U.S. cities for work, you still can't grasp how shitty U.S. public transport is in 99% of U.S. cities, yeah. New York is about the only place in the U.S. that has good public transit, and people in New York probably don't even think it's good. But it's probably the best in the U.S. that I know about. Okay. Oh, come on, game! Come on! Good job, Neo. Good dodges. Oh, fuck there it you, is, there it is. Uh, Rand getting to space. But Rand getting to space to I can vent myself is really expensive. What do I do? Uh, spell check first, because I'm unsure what your sentence is supposed to mean. Um, but call your local Tesla dealership. I don't know. DC has pretty good transit, mass transit. There you go. DC and New York are probably the two best in the U.S. would be my guess. To be fair, the quality of DFW Transit is terrible, but its coverage is good for American standards. <laughs> I don't know. I mean... Fuck you, FTL. Um, good for American standards is like saying... I have to eat trash for breakfast every day. But at least I have trash to eat. So damn it. I don't I don't know if I still count that as good.
People in the States love cars. True. Oh, man, it would help if I turn my O2 on. All right, do I refresh my dudes? I would lose some training. I don't think I will. Isn't Chicago decent, too? I don't know. I've never been there. DFW is for sure the best public transit in Texas. Man, I have a hard time believing that. But okay, I'll take your word for it. People with public transit like New York City and Boston don't realize that they have what they have and they think it's terrible. Brand, I think he was asking whether or not you've really been far even as decided use even go want to do more like. Totally, yes, I have. Maybe yes, probably. Um, not just bikes on YouTube is doing good coverage on that subject. May not be good, but it's above average. And above average means that at least half is worse. Yeah, good to know. Uh, I mean, what do I do with 17 scrap at the store? I can sell stun bomb and maybe get a little an eye on, maybe? The issue in the US is the monstrous urban sprawl. Okay. Do I ever keep a stun bomb? The swarm missile, I don't think we do. Do I ever buy backup battery here? As much as I'd like to, I think I can't. Well, I need to still buy hacking and a weapon. It's wild. The only place in the U.S. that people may take transit more than they drive is New York City. Los Angeles, total crap. Miami takes you from, like, nowhere to nowhere. It's not just about good transit. It's also about how far you have to go to get to work and to get groceries. Okay. Uh, I think we just save here. I could buy back a battery, but I feel like I shouldn't yet. It's good. It's free stuff. I like free stuff. Battery charger for my backup battery I didn't buy. Okay. What the hell? Sure, I'm glad I keep getting this quick swarm missile shot off. People talk about how um, being able to sucker punch weapons with this ship with a quick swarm missile makes it good. Not freaking good. Swarm missile sucks. It's already it already is slow to get the full value. It has no accuracy, and you still have to use a missile to use it. I. Swarm Missile is probably the best missile, or maybe second best, and it's still terrible. It's like the public transportation DFW. It's the best in Texas, and it's still the worst. The worst is Phoenix, Arizona. Go try to ride the bus where, there while you get cooked. Nah, doesn't sound fun. In New York, your brother's grocery store is right across the street. <laughs> it was so nice. Not shit on U.S. too much. Canada is, with the expectation of, of exception of Montreal, equally poopy. Yeah, I guess North America is just bad at public transit. Like, refuses to spend the money to do it, or it's just two big spaces between everything, or spread out, or whatever. Artemis is probably the best missile in the game, yeah. Uh... Swarm is less good against auto ships because all two tile rooms. True, true. All right, safe fight, so I don't have to use a missile. Good. I want to go. For, is there ever a crew kill here? I like take out O2 or something. Three humans, no repair drone. I guess I can try. We got a breach or something. Problem is, he might run. That's French Canada. They're different in all aspects. Mexico City has pretty good public transportation. Okay. California voted in 2008 to do high-speed rail, and they've spent 10 billion and haven't laid a mile of track. Not sure how that works, but okay. It was all planning so far? I mean, what have they done with $10 billion? Our plans are measured in centuries in California. Nice, nice. Uh, 
Uh, DC Metro is great once you're in DC and good from the close in suburbs, but the sprawl is huge and you still need to drive just to get close. Yeah, that's kind of what Dallas is like. Unless you live right by a station, you have to drive 20 minutes to get to a train station, probably from most areas. And then what's the point? Just drive the rest of the 20 minute commute you would have had anyway. There it is, that's the crew kill, just wait. They made plans for it in California, they kept changing it. That's the problem with California, they just keep changing it, huh? That sucks. The Incas had public llama transportation, sort of. Okay. You've been playing Tekite and Osprey the last few days on your max score hunt. Both currently on 6228. You got wins, but always worse score. Rudy Van Winkler, if you really want to score farm, just play a ship with cloaking, hacking, mind control, and dive forever. I just, I, I honestly don't see the point of trying to score farm. Unless you're trying to do it without score farming. Um, dot price, thank you for three months in a row. Sorry to read about my car. Yeah, it was, it's not a great morning. But I appreciate it. Okay. Worst ion in the game and two other missile weapons. That's my choice at this store. Well. It was a bonus store, so don't look a gift bonus store in the mouth. Do I need to buy missiles right now? I'm only going into sector two, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna invest in anything yet. Unless I want to buy a fuel or two. Uh, could buy an NG. Hmm. I think I still want to do nothing. Really? You think I need to pick up the heavy ion? Oh my god, that sounds terrible. You would say pick up Heavy Ion after saying don't sell Swarm for Charge Laser? <laughs> really? They have me by the balls legally or can I dispute the towing? I... I've already paid for it, for one thing, Muhammad. I already picked it up and paid for it. How the hell do you dispute something through a business? It's not through a government towing. I don't think disputing a business towing is a thing. That was before we had second shield. There's a charge laser here. Now you'd want it. Yeah. Sucks, but it gives a failsafe in case of no weapons in stores in Sector 2. Um, I wish I could see what Sector 2 would be. How much does this cost? I'd get 22 back. I'm going to buy it. I have no plans of using it unless we have safe fights where I just don't want to use missiles. Failsafe, I, I can kind of see that. Actually, this might... Strangely, get immediate value getting through the Zolt and Shield quicker. Small claims court. Jesus Christ. Do people actually do that? Dispute towing in small claims court? That sounds like more of a hassle than paying the $360 I had to get my car back. That sounds terrible. No offense. That sounds terrible. I'd have to sue them. God. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm, I'm not going to do that. What is that link? I don't know what that is. The value isn't worth taking to court. The time would not be worth even if you won. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it would not be worth. How the hell? He has two Zoltans in here keeping his missile online, doesn't he? Weird. There's no way I'm going to go to small claims court. <sighs> Especially with, as much as I'm complaining, like, I was in the wrong. I parked in a restricted spot. Now, if I argued that I live in this apartment and every parking spot in my parking lot was taken except for the reserved parking spot, I don't think that would hold up in any court ever. Like... Would that ever hold up in court? And how would you even prove that? <clears throat> I didn't take a picture of every parking lot showing how full it was. How in the hell could you ever prove that? America has wild systems. The idea of a private company having jurisdiction like that is wild. I'm sure, if you took it to an attorney and they discover some type of pattern of illegal towing, they would work for free. It's not illegal towing. If you had a spare Wednesday, it would be fun. That just sounds like the least type of fun I can think of. 
Your best odds for winning small claims is the other party doesn't show up and you get an auto win because of that. Uh, not worth. Where should you have parked is the wild thing. Well, and that's that would be my only claim. My only claim would be literally the only places to park was a handicap spot that was open and reserve spots that I parked in that I got towed from. Jesus, ions and missiles. That is all of my options here. The burden of proof is on them that they towed properly. HOA owns the parking lot. It's not an HOA, it's an apartment complex. Are you holding a parking spot? No, there. I don't get a parking spot in my apartment complex. You have to reserve one. No, you have to pay to get a covered parking spot, but there's a waiting list because there's not enough for the people that live here. Do I buy this ion stunner? Yeah, I think I do. So it's a shit system that I'm getting screwed by. No, I didn't have a regular spot which somebody took. There is open parking is what they call it, where anybody can park anywhere, whether you live here or not. People who live here do not have any parking reserved. You have to pay for extra parking, but there's not enough spaces for the people that work here, that, that live here, so I'm on a waiting list. I can get revenge by wasting their time. I don't want revenge. I don't want to be one of those people who goes to court over stupid bullshit. I just don't want to be one of those people. I'm not, I'm not doing that. I value my time more than getting revenge on other bullshit. I value my time more than that. Would I ever get my 380 bucks back? I doubt it. And if I hired a lawyer, I'd spend way more than the 300 bucks to hire a lawyer. Like, there's just... There's nothing positive about trying to sue over something like that. In my opinion, anyway. Now you're curious about whether Ion Center plus Heavy Ion is able to O2 crew kill in safe fights. You think it probably could? Well, if I get a safe fight, we can test it, I guess. IRL stream coming, Rand vs. Evil Towing Company. Again, I don't even blame the towing company. I blame my apartment complex. The towing company was just hired by my apartment complex to tow people who are in violation of their towing, their parking rules. If you're living in the U.S. People sue the living crap out of each other for every scrap. I know, and you know what I would claim? That's one of the many things that make America suck. Make America great again. Make America suck more. Sue for everything. Uh, sounds like a lose-lose. Yeah, for sure. You could dispute in case the charges are excessive. You're in jest, by the way. You don't hate the towing company either. You just think an IRL court stream is a funny idea. Sue my apartment complex. I'm trying to say the headache is not worth $380. That's what I'm saying. If I was one of those people who's like, I'm going to get on my soapbox and I'm going to do everything because what I stand for is more important than any inconvenience, then sure. If I really thought I was in the right and the apartment complex was in the wrong, I would do that. And I think that, but I also don't think it enough to inconvenience myself over the court case I'd have to make over some bullshit like that. So, Is that a regular amount of charge? I don't know. Let's look it up. We're going to keep chatting about this. <laughs> Dallas towing costs. Fees and payments. Dallas Police Department. Towing fees. Regular total, $139. Medium, $219. Heavy, $509. Storage fee, $20. Impound fee, $20. Notification fee, $50. 8.25% 8 8 sales tax apply. So, $139. Plus 20, 40. So it would be like a little under 200 if you're like in downtown Dallas or something. And mine was towed from where I live to about 10 to 15 miles away. There you go. Was what I paid worse than it could have been? Looks like it was probably about average. Um, 
You are in the wrong. That's now clear to me. Still doesn't entitled to telling people to extort you. Sales tax applies to the fee? Of course. Of course, it's America. It's America. Here, you know what? I'm gonna, I got my, uh, well, I, this is a safe fight. I'll go get my receipt. I'll be right back, Jack. Here we go. Uh, let's see. Peak auto storage. Private property tow. Reason for tow. Unauthorized parking. Unauthorized. Um. Let's see here. Tow fee, two hundred and seventy-two dollars. Storage fee, twenty-two eighty-five. Tax, $5.66. Storage charges total, $74.21. I don't know where that comes from. Grand total, $346.21. I don't know where the storage charges, how it got from $22 to $74. Days in storage, two. Now that's some bullshit. It was towed at 9 p.m. last night. I picked it up at, at 11.30 a.m. this morning. And they charge me for two days of storage. Now that's pretty bullshit. They charged me for two days of storage when they towed it at 9.35 p.m. And I, and I picked it up at 11.30 a.m. this morning. It's fucking calendar days. Fucking scam bullshit, man. That is such bullshit. No training. What was I going to train? There was an ion and every, everybody's cross-trained on everything. There's nothing to train. There's my dispute. Yeah, but what leg do I have to stand on? It was two calendar days. It was impounded on April 8th, released on April 9th. That's two days. I don't have a leg to stand on, I'm sure, even if I was willing to dispute it. Um, I was kind of ripped off. I mean, it's a towing fucking agency, of course. Every Everything's a rip-off on those things. Of course, there's a quest over there. Probably my second store's over there, too. Phone company are scum, generally. Do know full well what they can and can't do. Yeah, I'm sure everything did they did was completely legal. I'm sure it was completely legal. I really have... I'm, I'm quite sure trying to fight something like this would be not even worse. Uh, not even worth. It's a scummy thing on two calendar days. Scummy does not mean illegal. And how do you dispute scum? You, you don't. Pretty sure you can't dispute scummy practices. Or else half the businesses that exist in the U.S. wouldn't exist, probably. Base cost seems very high. Doesn't sound like it'd be particularly helpful to take on. Uh, you can be sure a kickback to the housing people happened. What I might do is, I might just take this to my apartment complex office, show what they cost me because their fucking parking situation is so shitty. Like, you caused me to have to pay for two days of impound because you don't have enough parking spaces or reserve spaces for people who pay $1,500 a month to rent an office, to rent a, an apartment here. That's really bullshit scummy. So, B may be charged for any part of the day the vehicle is on the lot except the vehicle is on the lot for two calendar days within a 12 hour period for example a vehicle comes in at 10 at night uh, the owner comes and gets the vehicle at 8 the next morning even though the vehicle is on the lot for two calendar days you may only charge one day storage since it's within 12 hour period 12 hours is a kicker yeah and even though I got there it was actually released at 10.44 a.m. and it was towed at 9.33 p.m. last night. So I missed the 12-hour period by about an hour. An hour or two. About an hour. Beat scum with scum. Fun part is they're not that much expensive that people just take matter to court and pay legal fees. You would frame it because you tow the vehicle so late at night. I got whacked for two calendar days. Why the heck was it towed? Because I parked in a reserved spot. 
because my choices to park were a reserved spot or a handicap spot. So I could be illegal in a handicap spot, illegal in a reserved spot, or park two, uh, two blocks away. Those were my choices. Those are my choices. How did I know it was? Because I was told when I started living in this apartment that covered parking is reserved. I'm pretty sure there are signs that say reserved. Um, so I can't I can't argue ignorance. And I think I need to buy this chain laser here. I mean, I could, but I'd be lying. Which, you know, with how scummy all this shit is, maybe I should just lie. I'm gonna do this and hacking. Um, I think I want to buy backup battery too. I'm not a very good liar, to be honest, though. I probably wouldn't be able to stand up a court and lie and say I didn't know. Uh, actually, I'm going to just do all this. I'm going to do all these upgrades. Um... You're curious if I got notified or just discovered it was gone. No, I was not notified that it was towed. I just walked outside and my car was gone. So I was never notified. Was I supposed to be notified? Is there a... Is that is that you're saying would I have a... I have a leg to stand on that I was not notified of my car being towed? I picked correctly because Handy's cap spot is 1250 ticket. The sad thing is, I bet you I wouldn't have been towed if, if I had parked in handicap parking because nobody ever parks in the handicap parking at my apartment complex. Nobody ever does. They're just sitting there. The space is nobody using them. So I bet you if I chose that, I wouldn't have gotten a ticket. But I'm not a douchebag who parks in Go fuck handicap parking, so I didn't do that. At least I didn't get charged the notification fee. I know how to get back at them. Keep parking there. Tell them that you can do this all day. You got mad Twitch money. Yeah, that's... That's a lie. I am poor. Poor enough for $380. Is not... A small amount of money to me. Uh, problem with lying is that you have just considered doing it in front of 100 people and a public view Twitch bot on your YouTube video. I know. I, I wouldn't actually try to do that. How would they notify him in less than 12 hours? I don't know. They can tow in less than 12 hours. How'd the eclipsing go? It was fine. Kind of ruined by my tow get my car getting towed overnight, but whatever. Here's how my court testimony goes. Your Honor, I am not guilty. Communist brain eating slugs from the dark side of the sun forced me to do it. What's the mod to show rebel advance lines? Type exclamation point mods. It'll tell you how to get the mods. You may have a leg to stand on in terms of the time, because if they never notified you, how would you get your car back in one day? I don't know. Is anybody here a lawyer? I feel like unless you're a lawyer... I... The last uh, apartment complex I lived on, I actually... contacted a friend of mine who was a lawyer to ask if I had a leg to stand on about a dog barking because of neglect that was causing me to stay up that was that was keeping me up at night and I didn't I didn't have a leg to stand on so like unless anybody wants to be my free uh, counsel I most likely will not be attempting to um, dispute this we are all unqualified self-described experts sounds about right this is the internet after all Uh, state laws are the tricky part because you need to be a lawyer in Texas to know all these different rules. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure it is. Put that money into the cost of having a car bucket. They even go to a store with 27 scrap. Sell something? God, it's 
it's not even worth going to the store with 27 scrap, is it? Sell something for an Ion Blast Mark 1. Can I sell both of these for a flak? This is 10 and 15. I don't even think I can. It's 25 in total. That puts me at 50. I could buy like a Burst Laser Mark 1 or a Heavy Laser. I don't even know if that's worth. The only law you're confident to talk about is shopping, shipping law. So if you ever have your ship towed, no pun intended, intended, call me. Oh my god. Friedrich just gifted another 10 subs. Well, you all are at least helping pay for this with all the support today. Thank you, everybody who's doing that. I guess I'll, it cost me, uh, one, two, three, one, two. It cost me one fuel to check. It cost me one fuel to check. Is there anything I'd actually uh, buy? Uh, save the fuel, honestly. Sure, I don't have my missiles anymore. Help oh, repair, okay. Abandon 3 is actually good. Yeah, I think after the stream, I'm gonna go to the office and ask how I file a complaint about their parking. I wanna show this, this towing receipt as my reason for complaint. Holy free firebomb. Holy free firebomb, okay. Even if it does nothing, I feel like it's worth telling them that their situation is shitty and they need to do something about it and have a, a complaint on file with how shitty their parking situation is. All right, that's a map. That shows me my two stores, that's nice. If I complain enough, maybe they'll just give me a parking spot to shut me up. That, the problem is that there just aren't any. Like, the reason I didn't get one when I first moved here is because when I first moved here, I said, is there any reserved parking? They said, there is, it's covered parking, it's paid, but there's a waiting list. That's what they told me. And when I went today to say, I'm towed, how do I get a parking spot? They said, yeah, there's a waiting list. So there's literally no way to do it because there's a waiting list. It's appropriate to talk to them at least. I already talked to them once today. I'm pretty sure I talked to people who have no control over it because I'm pretty sure I saw a woman who was like the um, manager or whatever, just walk by as I was talking to two people who are looking at me, doe-eyed, wishing I would stop telling them about my car being towed. Because there's nothing they can do about it because it's the fucking people who run the apartment complex, I'm sure. Uh, this should be a crew kill, actually. So what I need to do is go in and say, I need to talk to the manager, and that's what I need to do. So I can tell them, your parking situation sucks. You're causing your tenants to have to pay extra money for towing because you don't have enough parking. What are you going to do about it? That's what I need to do. I need to, I need to be a Karen, which sucks, because I hate being that kind of person. I need to actually be a Karen if I want anything to happen. Give the receptionist three hundred and eighty dollars to get moved out the waiting list. There you go. Make it so I spend over seven hundred bucks to be able to park at my own parking at my own uh, my own complex. Right, this will crew kill. Is a mortgage worse than paying rent in Texas? I have no idea, sir. Bro, I've never paid a mortgage. Am I on the list? I got put on the list today. They're totally in cahoots with the tow company, maybe. Weird, most apartments you live in, they have some stickers to show residents from non-residents. My last apartment complex did have that. This one doesn't. They have open parking. Left for 30 minutes, we're still talking about parking. Yes, house. We are. Because we're adults who complain about shitty living conditions. That's what we do. <clears throat> Once you get into your 30s, 40s, 50s, <clears throat> you just um, complain about how shitty life is all the time to everybody. So that's what it's like. Or maybe you are at that age and you don't do it. I don't know. More power to you if you don't complain about this stuff all the time. Cause... Okay, 
Now safe fight. I forgot to move you back here. This timing's not a deal here. Do this. Um, they can charge you 1500 for rent with so bad conditions they probably won't care about your complaints or the parking situation as they can easily find a new tenant. Potentially. Wow, that's a really good bribe. Okay. That's why I say, I've been saying, even if I go complain, it probably won't do anything. But I at least want to have a complaint on file to say their parking situation is bad and they should change it. They should either give the tenants who live here a parking sticker so that people who don't live here aren't allowed just to park wherever they want, which they would probably still do anyway. But then at least I'd have something to say, I have a sticker, they don't. Why aren't they getting towed? Why am I the person who live here, lives here getting towed when people who don't live here aren't getting towed? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I can get one more jump. Get both stores. Complaining gives us the drive to keep going. There you go. Okay. Kind of bad. Not great stuff. Can I actually get cloaking here? If I sell two weapons, I can get cloaking. I don't want to do that. Parking's that bad. You're surprised they don't have a sticker system already. Police it better. Well, maybe not enough people have complained, so I guess I will get to be the person who gets to start that ball rolling, maybe. Um, I think I'm just going to buy mind control here instead. Is that what I'm going to do? Buy a small bomb. Come by to watch stream even on vacation in Prague. Nice. Thanks, Frozer Jim. That can be me, the sticker guy, sure. I'm just going to do this and keep the firebomb. What if there's a crew kill opportunity somewhere along the way here? That's true. Okay. Damage here, aren't I? Oh, good. The dodge saved us. It's like if we don't dodge, I'm taking damage here. What's my average streak length? No idea. We have we have a thing that tracks it that you can do some math if you'd like to. I have no idea. Also, personal. Don't ask me about my length. Giggity. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I don't know why I had to make that stupid joke. I don't know. Uh, he does have mind control. I want to take advantage of that. I mean, I have mind control. Let's use it. Don't call me Shirley. Okay. Yes, there's the, um... There's the uh, spreadsheet if we want to do some math to figure out our average, my average streak length. Stupid joke kept me from making a math meth joke. Okay. <laughs> Good. We're on the wavelength, same wavelength of stupid jokes, I guess. On weapon blue option, that's nice. There's gonna be two stores with cloaking that I'm not gonna afford because I bought that mind control that last store. Okay, at least at least I can say I didn't miss out on my chance for it by doing that. Uh I wanna buy drone parts. I'm at eight drone parts. I kinda just wanna get power and hacking upgrade right now, so yeah, let's do that. And 
add one more power. So now I can back up battery, mind control, hack to that kind of stuff. Yeah. I'd like to be able to use my mind control offensively, but I need to either need to have an extra crew to put on sensors or buy sensors, and I don't want to buy sensors right now. Just finished watching all my satisfactory videos on YouTube. Do I think I'll play when it launches this year? Uh, it's launching this year, huh? Thank you for the follow, Ricardo. Um, probably. I love that game. Most likely, I will. I did not know it was coming out in full release this year, though, honestly. I'm about to not be able to dodge this missile, aren't I? Okay, good. At least it doesn't get the fire. The devs make videos on YouTube and they announced full release 2024. Well, I hope that wasn't false info or overly optimistic like so many video games. <laughs> but probably I will. I I'm not going to make any promises because I never know what my plan is for games that I'm going to play. So I will say maybe. I will say I'll definitely play it at some point. I don't know if it'll be this year. Depends on what's come, when it comes out, what else is out. If there's anything else I'm just dying to play. If I'm in the middle of some ginormous challenge, like I'm trying to do my WoW Hardcore Classic to level 60 first character kind of thing. Man, I don't want to hack every fight, but like every fight is missiles, so... F your goddamn missiles. Six fuel, one drone part. Nah, if it's two drone parts, I probably would have taken that, because six fuel, two drone parts is actually max on both of those. Oof. Almost crew kill. Oh, damn, that extra asteroid might have stopped us from keep doing that. You love watching my WoW videos too? Oh, well, nice. I'm glad you like my videos then. Most people are like, uh, play. you should play FTL more. <laughs> That's what most people say. Ran, this is a weird FTL mod. That's people's favorite way of saying they wish I wasn't playing, they wish I was playing FTL instead of whatever non FTL game I'm playing. This is a weird FTL mod, Rand. It's actually a really good deal. Yeah, I'm gonna take that deal. Pirate or pirate, such great choices. I guess I'll go up since we have green over there. Based on the win-loss record only, the average streak is 4.14. Well, that's slower than I was hoping. Damn. I still, I can't afford cloaking. So I could go... One, two, three. If I don't go that way, I can go back and around or something. Uh, any here of interested in Blight Survival? <sighs> okay, uh, one second. They're in my clone bay, damn it. And, okay, do I vent them in time? humans. Okay, good. Okay, never mind my control. Okay, I think we got this. Three human borders. Thank God for mind control there, honestly. Uh, I don't know what Blight Survival is, so I don't think I've heard of that. If that's a video game you're recommending. Most of the games I look out for are like MMOs. I know MMOs dead genre, but... That's the games I'm looking forward to to play for fun. So Ashes of Creation is the one that I always talk about. More FTL, please. I want you to lose your mind quicker. The curse mod... Cursed mod gotta grow. You're all in on WoW Hardcore. Saved you the trouble of actually playing it yourself. Nice. 
Games be playing as Miles Morales swings by the stream. I know, I still need to play Miles Morales Spider-Man. It's, it's been on my list forever. I don't know that I go to the store, honestly. If I can't get cloaking, I could buy a heavy laser one. You get burned down on FTL often, so wow, and other streams are good for you. Unless it's a high streak, then you shiznit your pants watching. Nice. We'll kill him. Good stuff. My, potentially my only store of the sector. I backtrack if I go there. I mean, if there's a flak or a burst laser 2 or a heavy laser 1, I'm gonna buy it. So I guess I check it. Using the runs page, your average streak is 5.07. Okay. This was definitely not a store worth coming to. I guess I'll buy a couple drum drones, though. I think I need those. Sounds like a pretty low average, honestly. Only five. Somebody said 4.14. You said 5.07. Oh, wait. You said both those numbers. Based on the win-loss record. Based on the runs. Okay. Uh... God. Fucking Pirate Disruptor. Go fuck yourself, MTL. <laughs> Missile, drones, and fucking hacking. How did you dodge Good everything? Dodge at least. What? My fucking drone disappeared. Or one of my God shots just fucking disappeared. Fucking damn it, game! What the actual fuck? My ion stunner shot just didn't do anything. Okay, weapons down. Take down his drone control. Fucking hell. So this is beam drones offline. Okay, it's delayed. Okay. Right, is there a crew kill here? These guys are the last two alive, maybe. Alright. Uh, are you looking forward to Blight? What is that? What is Blight? I've not heard of that. Unless you, unless you sent me a uh, Steam list, a Steam link, and I looked at it and forgot about it. I don't remember it. An average of five wins is over an eighty percent win rate. Oh, okay, I guess that's not bad. Surprising lack of free crew so far. Is it surprising? I'm not sure how surprising that is. All right, so one more nebula. It's me an extra jump. I might as well go through both because it lets me see if there's a second store. For sure it's one to two stores in pirate sectors, so. Eat this. And if any of these are manly search, that's good for us. Again, I don't want to hack weapons every single fight, but I need to hack weapons every single fight because every goddamn ship's got frickin' missiles. Is that a rock and a mantis? Yes, it is. I wonder if there's ever a crew kill here, then. Hard to crew kill with... Well, maybe. Actually, maybe. If I let him repair one level of this and then make them fight in there, I think I might be able to crew kill this. What the hell is that long thing, Eagle's Eye? Is that the the game? You block origin has prevented the following page from loading. That is a lot of uh, yeah, I don't I don't know if I'm gonna put that through, sorry. <laughs> Use that to do this. I should pull the guy. Okay. He gets below 30, and that's the crew kill. There it is. Beautiful. Another free stun bomb. Okay. 
Firebomb? Oh, that's true. I could use Firebomb for crew kill too, but I'll just do it the difficult way, I guess. This is the link you were looking for. Steam-powered Blight Survival. Okay. All right, I'll check that out later. Medieval Co-op Extraction Light. Interesting. What is Extraction Light? Is that like um, PUBG or something? Hey, who said light on the free crew? We finally got it. Save you there, but have you start on doors. Three shields. Oh, this is a fucking ridiculously strong ship. Um, okay, hack the weapons. Okay, everything but the missile offline. Two, three, four, five, six. I just think that's a six power weapon system, six power shield system. And actually, I can see that it's a six power weapon system. Okay. Right. Go for a crew kill, except that this ship is so stupidly overpowered, I don't want to. And I've done too much damage, that's not really happening unless I firebomb, and it'll still probably burn a ship down too quickly. If I do this, will that pull him? Let's see here. I'm gonna wait for the hacking to be available so I can let him through. Actually, with Firebomb, I might be able to do it. Firebomb does 30 crew damage. I need him to be in the weapons room. Okay, I think I think I can actually do this. Because if I lock him in with hacking and firebomb him, he should take the 8 damage plus the 30. So basically, wait for him to repair shields. Then he goes in the weapons. We let him in, lock him in, firebomb him. That should do it. That'll do it. Beautiful. Okay. Woo! Okay. Nice double reward. There's no PvP in Blight, so it's a Tarkov. Oh! I didn't know Tarkov, Escape from Tarkov, was PvE. Wow, um, okay, what do I want to use here? Any of this? I have, like, just the all-star mediocre weapons except for maybe Ion Stunner and Crystal H. None of these are weapons that I'm just like, oh, I'm so glad I have this. Um, but I'd rather have them than not have them, I guess. I'm trying to decide if I want to do like a engine upgrade. I can still have enough for cloaking. I want to do a weapon upgrade. Do I have any other one power weapon? Just a stun bomb. I could go chain charge if I do this. Chain charge. Do I like that better? I feel like that's slower. Chain charge would charge in 16, 15, three shots. So in 16 seconds, I'd have five shots. Huzzah, you got your double monitors working finally. Nice, M Pain Train. It's pretty awesome. I guess I'll do that. I feel like I need to get something going here. I could go one more weapon upgrade and even get the Crystal H with that. Small chance for a second store in uh, pirate sector, though. So one, two, three, four. I'll have, I'd have to dive if there's a store down here anyway.
All right, three human. At least, well, he didn't bring snacks, but at least we didn't take damage or anything. Uh, what about upgrading defenses and going for crew kills with firebomb? Um, so unarmed potatoes, what what defense upgrades would I get that protects me from missiles? My defenses are upgraded in the fact that I have hacking to hack their weapons. So upgrading my shields does not help me against missiles. Getting third shield helps me, I guess, against asteroid field plus double offensive drones. There's, in my opinion, there's not. It, it it's probably worth to do that, but doesn't feel that worth to me. Fuck, I should have just... Speaking of, I should have just fucking hacked his weapons and I didn't, and I'm getting fucking paid, uh, paying the price for it right now. And I didn't... I didn't flash my shields or anything. It would help me against this fight. <sighs> okay. Don't you love it when people say, by the way, this thing that's happening to you right now, if you'd done what I'd said three seconds ago, you'd be in better shape. I, that's my favorite type of back backseating right there. It's my absolute favorite. Honestly, no, I don't think it would have helped because it's a fucking pulsar. No, I don't think it would have helped in this fight. A fucking pulsar would have taken down any number of shields. What would have helped if I just did the shit that I said and hacked his weapons from the beginning there? Ah, oh, man, I'm so negative. I don't I don't want to be so negative. I just... I'm just always negative. I guess maybe I do want to be negative. I don't know. Just hack weapons every time, Ran. Just do it. Just do it. If I tell the Iron Plus no, I'll legally can't enter my ship. Okay. Fucking disruptors, man. Oh, Jesus Christ, and I just came from No-02. I think I actually have to hack his hacking here. The fuck? Why did his O2? Oh, because I hacked it. That's why. Wow. I hacked his O2. I hacked his hacking, so he stopped hacking my O2. When it wore off, he rehacked his O2. Rehacked my O2. Fuck you, FTL. Good deal. Take it. All right, you fix that. Pulsar scale with a mana powering system would probably leave you with one shield at most. Not enough. Third shield wouldn't do much. It's. Oh, I watched the my Copley video about how pulsars work. It's something like, it's half rounded down, just like the shield hack or something stupid. So even if you have three shields, I think you have one shield and a value point, which would have been one value point more than. I know when the when the pulsar hits you, it's half rounded down. So I think I'd, I think I would still only have one shield when the pulsar hits. So whatever. It maybe would have been better to have third shields. I don't care. It's results based analysis. I'm not upgrading my shields yet because what if there's a store with cloaking? Damn it. Damn it. Now I have to decide if I dive for a store. I have so much shit. Yeah, I feel like I have to dive for this store. And if we're diving, the correct way to do it is go one, two, three, dive. Wow. Wow. We get cloaking, the dive's good. If the store doesn't have cloaking, I will need to do a bunch of upgrades in my engines and hack them three and try to not die, I guess. Specialty auction for 17. No, I'm trying to buy cloaking. What's our next sector choices? Mantis or Zoltan? Okay. This game is easy if you just know what's going to happen ahead of time and do that thing. I know, right? I should really do that more. 
Automated reloader, huh? Okay. Please have cloaking. Please have cloaking. Please have cloaking. Okay, all right, all right. Results-based analysis says the dive was correct. Now I need fuel. Um... You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna sell firebomb. Am I? Phase one crew killing with firebomb. I have cloaking hacking mind control. Um. Hmm. What I'm thinking about doing is getting this Crystal H online so I can have Charge 2 Chain and Crystal H right now, which would be pretty darn good for a... It'll be okay for a 6 power weapon system. The neat thing about being in chat, whatever decision or indecision pans out badly, we can complain about it. True, just like me and my life, I guess. I'm gonna sell this. I'm gonna sell this. I'm gonna do this upgrade. I was thinking about buying a drone part, but I am... Two scraps short, sadly. Okay, so we hack weapons. We have all of our systems done going into Sector 5, which is amazing. It's amazing. Well, hack cycle, firebomb, crew kill. I don't plan on firebombing. No. But yes, cloak hack cycling I will do plenty of, so yes. Yes to that, no to the other, most likely. Nice. All right, that looks like a damageless thing if our shields up in time. Perfect. Damageless dive. Beautiful. Now we got to decide between this crap. Um. Zoltan Border Police or Mantis Border Police? Um, two guaranteed stores in Zoltan. I feel like I'm pretty strong against Mantis, honestly. I have the mind control counter or mind control to deal with their borders. Uh, I don't have to get through Zoltan shields. I feel like it's Mantis here. Rand, in all your years of FTL, how many times have I made it to the crystal sector? 20? I don't know. Not, there's no way I can keep track of a stat like that. I have no idea. 20 is probably high. 5 or 10? I don't know. Not very often. The thing is, I play a lot of modded, and a lot of modded gives you tools where you end up there more often, too. So I just... I don't know that I can even begin to guess a random stat like that. Your favorite was the last time when it happened near the end of Sector 7, huh? Do I have an ion on my bar? I do. And we have cloaking, but ion I think is better. Okay, what's my goal here? Get power? Get cloak two? Cloak two, power, so we get our cloak hack cycle. It's probably the play. About once a year? Sure. Sure. <laughs> I really have no idea. Alright, I want to try to not use a drone part here. Beautiful. Um, the one guy went back. Is there a crew kill here? Oh, it's these guys. Weapon, whatever. Okay, uh, did I do enough damage to stop them from running? No, I didn't. So I guess I'm following them for a weapon. Unless I want to hack after them. All right. Maybe we can actually get a good weapon from weapon collectors. That's what they're called, weapon collectors. I don't have a Sleeping Dragon to tell me, hello, weapon collectors. <laughs> so I always delayed response to that. 
Oh, Jesus. Oh, what a shitty layout again. This whole entire part of the sector is freaking isolated. Nine, eight. Wow, this thing isn't even, this isn't even in seven. What a shitty layout, man. Oh, God damn it. I can't get this in seven to make it seven, eight, nine. I could get ten if there's like a jump here. To get this quest, I have to go here and then backtrack. What a f oh, this is stupid. So it's to be here in six. Six, five, four, three. Jesus Christ, this is terrible. Every time you look back at the stream, my ship is below seventy percent net oxygen. Okay. Again, try to not use a drone part. These fucking dodges! Wow, we hit a missile. We hit the missile after we'd already dodged it to completely waste one of our shots. I only have five missile or five drone parts. That's why I'm trying to not hack any of these fights. Do your friends, please. TP level three, huh? That's whatever. I don't care. <laughs> it's like. I could have TP level 20, I don't really care. Okay, wow, there's uh, another free weapon. Jose needs more time training on weapons there. Okay. Um, you're curious, you've never actually reached Crystal Sector through normal gameplay in five years. Well, um, if you really want to hit Crystal Sector, don't try to do it normally. Play this ship and look for Rock Homeworlds. Just unlock Roxy, go to look for Rock Homeworlds, you have a crystal crew, and then jump to every jump you can. That's the best way to do it. You won't see the quest beacon in the rock sector, but you just have to get lucky and find it. It's way easier than trying to do the correct find the damage stasis pod and all the other BS you have to do. This guy again. This, uh, this Mantis Sector is doing Mantis things. I probably should have hacked here. Okay, good. Hashtag never punished, I guess. Okay, that's how you got it finally after some grind. Was just wondering what my experience was. I mean, I've heard of people saying I got their crystal sector on my first run. Uh, it's it's rare. It's stupidly rare, and I don't ever try to force it. That's that's basically my entire opinion on it. It's a rare thing that you shouldn't try to force. Like love, I don't know. Um, probably my store is over at one of these dead ends somewhere. So this is, this is the rock, uh, this is the whatever uh, quest. This is the, so we're going to get a free weapon from this. So we're going to get boarded. Trying to go about unlock crystal ships via crystal sector made you want to drop FTL due to the spawning. Yeah, it's just, it's not worth stressing over. I just say, t I tell people, play the game normally. Um, and if you really, 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 really want to force the Crystal Sector, play FTL to you unlock unlock Roxy, and then go to Rock Homeworld to unlock Z. That's that's really the best way to do it. Sorry, we might even crew kill this guy, which I think we get multiple choices if we. Get him low enough. Alt 
multiple choices for a weapon. We force surrender. Ooh. That sells for a pretty good amount. Double laser charger mark two. Not really what I was hoping for. I was hoping for a heavy laser, burst laser, or halberd, or flak. But what if I turn this down and then get like a heal bomb or something? <sighs> kind of low on fuel. If I kill them, do I get fuel plus the weapon? I can't remember what the thing is if I kill them and get the weapon. I bet you it's lower scrap, but we get consumables. With seven fuel and six drone parts. And me not loving that weapon, I'm going to gamble a little bit. Let's finish him off. D -d Double kill. All right, now let's see if we can actually crew kill him though for it. We can get him to run through here. Lock him in there. This might just be the crew kill, and I'm not sure what that reward will be. Um, good, he won't put that out in time. Go double charge laser! Nah. Nah. Yeah, there we go. Let's see what this one... Let's see what the real reward is if we crew kill this guy. A fire beam! And two fuel and drone part. Okay. <laughs> A fire beam. Well, I got rid of the fire bomb earlier. Game really wants me to have fire beams today. Interesting. Okay. Now, do I want to get that on my bar somehow? For... Intimidate Settlers. Do this so I have Ion for the one blue option. Fire Beam for Intimidate Settlers. That's way better, totally. 100% better. Come on. Come on, Rand, you need fire. <laughs> Alright, well. I'm gonna go to there, and if I don't see a store up there, I'm gonna spend some scrap on some upgrades here. I got no fire! I need fire! I got no fire! I got no fire! <laughs> it took me a second to think. I should know that quote. Fifth element! Fifth element! I got no fire! I got no fire! I need no fire! <laughs> Good old Chris Tucker. Alright, uh. Dodge power. Uh. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. All right, I'm gonna actually hack shields here. Oh, this guy is fucking overpowered. Fucking rebel disruptors, man. Jesus Christ. Offensive drone, defense drone, flak one, heavy... Oh my god, this is a fucking stupid ship. This is a fucking stupid ship. I think I might need to run here. Holy shit, this ship. You can fucking kill the boss with this build. Fucking easily. God for that dodge. Uh, get me the fuck out. Holy shit. Holy shit, that was... Five, six, or seven drone power. One, two, three. Only like four weapon power, but this flak one heavy laser mini beam, which is like if I could choose a four power weapon system with viable weapons, and mini beam isn't even viable, I would buy that weapon system. That was actually insane. I don't have mind control for this shit. Uh... These fucking dodges! Holy shit, okay. Maybe I'll go work on this. Actually, let's go in here so I can mind control there. Oh god. Okay, vent them. Oh, thank you for repairing that while killing yourself. That is helpful of you. 
Right, is there a crew kill here after the BS of the last two jumps? Um, maybe. I want to keep them fighting in there. That was probably too much damage. That's not happening. Alright, well, that was a really shitty um, two jumps in a row. Let's refresh him. Sorry, bro. I know we're going to lose a little dodge training, but we're in a Mantis sector. I need some health. Same with you. That Rebel Disruptor had Flak 1, Heavy Laser 1, Mini Beam, three shields, Shield Drone, so effectively four shields, some sort of offensive drone, hacked my weapons. Like, apart from free shield hack plus weapon hack, it's like one of the worst events in the game right there. Jesus Christ. But hacking the medbay be worth it? I had already hacked weapons, I think. Even then... I don't know. Maybe I didn't hack weapons. Uh, I don't know. I don't know that the crew kill was going to be that worth there. Discretion, better part of val valor? Yeah, when you're fighting stupid, overpowered um, riggers, you get the hell out. You just get the hell out. Yeah, I gotta know when to fold them, and that was a we we fold them. Please don't be another disruptor. Okay, same weapon system. How did he dodge when I mind control the pilot? Okay, because apparently. He's got level 20 piloting where he loses zero dodges when piloting is mind controlled or something. Okay, what's up, Mike? What's up, Mike? What's up, fucking? We're good, we're good. All right, what about this one for crew kill? Uh, let him in. Go banana. You understand that reference? Uh, one of his best roles. One of Chris Tucker's best roles was. That's like that's like one of his first roles too, right? I feel like that was one of the first roles he ever had. Was. Ruby Rod, or Ruby Red, whatever his name was. Alright, um... Fire Beam can maybe do it. Let's see if we can make this quick kill happen. We let him repair the weapons to level 1, then we might control, let him fight each other, and then probably firebomb them. Fire Beam them. Fire something them. <laughs> Man, if I could actually control you in mind control, I'd want you to stay in there. So, stay in there. I don't know if that actually did anything, because fires did not go out. It's going to be close. He might get out of this room in time. Got him. Okay, next sector. Force Zilton. Mm, great. Amazing. Wonderful. That was a Simpsons reference and Pain Train did. Okay, nice, nice. Ralph Wiggum. Is he the... I smell... I smell burning. Is it that? Is it that kid? Smells like or tastes like burning. Is that is that Ralph Wiggum? Okay. Uh, what am I looking for? I got all my systems. So it's just weapon upgrades, right? So I can just start spending my scrap here. Um, let's go ahead and get third shield and a power. I'm banking my scrap kind of for no reason. I'm in danger. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, that's a good deal. I want to hope that that's not a store that I have to backtrack through. Something like that. 
That's actually the same episode as the Go Banana reference, too. Okay, nice. All right, free stuff. Uh, this is a good dive sector. How do I go about it? This in, like, 12 or something. 12, 11, 10. But, I mean, they're nebula. They're Zoltan nebula jumps, so... Dive is not actually that good. What I should probably do is just get, like... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Maybe one less. Two, three, five, six. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, something like that. Yeah, let's go something like that. That's where you saw the leprechaun. He told me to burn things. My neck hurts. My ear hurts. I have two owies. Okay, are we just quoting? <laughs> What's his face now? Uh, all right, now I'll get third shield on a uh, potato that you wanted me to do earlier. Now, now I finally got the third shield that you wanted me to get earlier. Delayed backseat gaming. I did it, just not when you wanted me to do it. Okay. Now we can stun you and probably eventually crew kill you, honestly. Why does the nebula look like a mirror image of the Korean Peninsula? Uh, I don't know. They're both in that room, so I'm just going to shoot them a bunch in there. Does that crew kill them? Almost. Almost got them. Why my control? Will they kill each other? I think I've done too much damage. Uh, so I think I actually need fire beam. Not this crew kill, so this... Still might be doable. If I do this... Oh, you are immune to that. Whoops. I don't think I'm actually going to be able to crew kill them now since they're not fighting each other. Kill them with fire. So close. So close. Ship's going to burn down. Um... Nebula looks like, what did you say? The mirror image of the Korean Peninsula. All right, not familiar with the Korean Peninsula, sadly. Uh, should I get doors? Clone Bay value? Something to protect me from losing crew. That's the way we die. Let's go Clone Bay value, but not doors since I have my control counter. Looks like pink slime. Okay. Yeah, that could have been free crew. Could have been a contender. Could have been free crew. Could have been somebody. Counter. Attempt to not. There's a drone part. He's not running at least. Double eye on. I'm going to cloak the bomb. A lot of there's a lot of dodges. This guy is freaking triple ion. Ion bomb, double ions. This guy really, really likes his ions. Okay, I gotta hack his weapons now. Okay, we finally hit his- okay, we hit his piling. He can't dodge anymore. God, what a crazy ship this is. Just uh, the crazy amount of dodges he has. Okay, we're good. And also my power is low, as usual. Alright, there's store. So do I greed for the store? Yeah, I think I do. Because what if Flak 1, Burst Laser 2, and Halberd Beam are all at that store? What were those dodges? Yeah, cheating AI. 
At least it isn't ran that looks like an inverted peninsula. True, I'm glad I don't look like whatever that would be. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, dive. On board, three boarders, we decide of boarding. Um Fuck. Okay, it's fine. He's just locked in there with two NGs. Alright. I was a little bit late on that. A little bit late on that. But it's fine. The fight is now safe. That was, again, a lot of dodges for a Zoltan on piloting. So useful. Uh, I need you to uh, mind control. What a frickin' boarding party. A bunch of uh, Zoltans and Engies. This is weird. Kill Heal Bay. Maybe I can crew kill this. Frickin' Zoltan Engie boarding party. Some shenanigans right here. Shenaniganery over here. Good double reward. The NG boarding party. Because you're amazingly petty, what is this? Uh, <laughs> a map of the Korean Peninsula shown next to that nebula. Well done. Looks looks amazing. Your your eye is impeccable, Jacob. Impeccable. Can't doubt it when you show like that. Can't even doubt it. I see it. I completely see it now that you've shown me. I've seen the light. Honestly, the fact that you realize that is pretty amazing because I I wouldn't have even known what the Korean Peninsula looks like. So, do you study geography? Are you from Korea? Uh, have you visited there? Do you have family there? How do you know? That's some... Good shape recognition there. It's the office, it's the same picture, yeah, right? Uh, you, you do a lot of uh, GeoGuessr, <laughs> maybe that's what it is. <laughs> uh, glad there is no Rand head in the globe picture. Any free crew? Yes. All of them are free, actually. We've had not a lot of people requesting names today. Devil Store. Two chances of good weapons. You don't know what to say? It just looked like it to you. Okay. None of those are good weapons. I think I buy an NG here. Do I ever keep either of these? Crystal H has anti-synergy with beams like fire beams, so... Double Ion is interesting. Alright, 100% I'm gonna do this. And get ourselves a silly device. So let's do that. Silly device is definitely needed. Rock time, okay. Now you can be this guy. I have played one time double ion. You can't do anything against the boss. Well, I don't like it, and I don't feel like I need to do it. I don't want to burst laser three either. Like, I don't really want any of this. But let me wait to see what's at the second store if I do anything else. I'm going to do that, a little repair. Could buy one more crew, like a Zoltan for shields or something, but... We still have a whole other sector to look at, so let's let's just check other store. See if we have better options. <laughs> Remember that charge two you turned down? 
You could have had three charge twos, Rand. I mean, Breach 2 is great. If I was boarding without boarding, I don't really love it. I could go double charge two chain laser. Sounds not that interesting. Oh, you want to be the crystal crew. All right, BJ, I'll get you. I think that's what your request is. Uh, crystal TLDR. Am I naming him TLDR or am I naming him BJA? We don't really need a slug pilot when we have mind control counter. If you had full training, I'd maybe consider it. Not really too early, it's that I don't need it when I have the mind control counter, in my opinion. It's nice, but not something I think it's worth spending 45 scrap on. Used to know a Serbian sound engineer. He knew a check one, two. A check, check, one, check, check, mic check, one, two. I get that. As a sound person, I get it. Um... We go charge two, charge two, fire beam, phase one for crew killing, then charge two, charge two, chain laser after phase one. I, I guess that's what I could do. Well, that seems amazing, but... 20 seconds. I will say, I will say charge two, full charge. Lines up perfectly with fire beam, so there is that. When is your sub ending? I don't know. Um, but thank you for continuing your sub. Appreciate it. I sold a charge too, so this feels a little weird to do that, but I'm just going to do it. Just do it. Just do it. All right. My options aren't any better, and it's fine. If I if I get nothing else, it's whatever. If I get nothing else, this is boss killable and, and good crew killable. A lot of laser shots. Potentially. Was it four, eight, ten laser shots for eight power? Meh. Meh. Do I care about nebula jumps? I have plenty of fuel, so why not? Zoltan nebula, so it might not be worth. If this is Zoltan great eye or empty, then it was definitely not worth. It's not really worth it. Okay. It's fine. It's basically a safe... Nebula dive is fine. You will continue to support me. I'm doing a great job. Well, thank you. That is very nice of you to say. Always appreciate that kind of positivity, that's for sure. A solid maneuver, why not? One flak down. One to go. Eh, just get out of here. Zoltan or Slug? Definitely Slug. Definitely Slug. One Zoltan is enough for me, and we somehow dodged Zoltan Border Police, so, you know, don't mind that at all. Alright, we got enough. Let's go ahead and get the O2 protection from Slugs. We don't really need anything else for the boss fight, but I'd like to get two more weapon power. So that's my goal. Weapon power and actual power. That's my goal for this Sector 7. If we find a store with better weapons, great. If not, whatever. All right. Um, so we attack the Mantis to save the slugs, and then we kill the slugs to get a double reward. That's the plan here. Okay, got some fires there, not bad. Do I want to go for a crew kill here? I don't know if crew killing does anything for this fight or not. I guess I could test it if I want to go for the crew kill here. Um, how would I do it? Mind control the NG... Do one damage. That was way more than one damage. Didn't mean to do that much. This... Okay. Oh my god. Level 3... I was level 3 clone bay and they dodged everything, so... 
I don't know if I can crew kill this now, unless I can get Fire Beam online, maybe. Whoops. And I don't think it's happening now. I'm pretty sure I did too much damage. Yeah, I think weapons burn down and he dies. Four oh two, our engines. One of those gonna burn down before he dies, isn't he? It's close. Oh well. Leave him off. Leave him off. Finish them off. Don't leave them be. We get the ex explosive replicator. All right. What an interesting bonus reward. Yeah, level three clone bay. If I didn't have to shoot so many shots at clone bay to get that down, I think we would have had the the crew kill. But that guy was. That guy was. A boarding, a boarding guy with level 3 clone bay. He was not letting his crew go down easy. Death by war crime. It's my favorite way. I bought a wooden whistle, but a wooden whistle. So I bought a steel whistle, but it's steel wooden whistle. So I bought a lead whistle, but it's steel wooden lead me whistle. Cool story, bro. Double eye on double beam. Four shields. I'm gonna hack shields here. Good dodges so far. I really wanna get. Poke me down, good. Poke this eye on. That's nice, shields on fire. Ah, I finished he fixed the poking already. Really fast repairs, his NG on repairs, yeah. The double charged laser will actually be pretty good. Actually, be, 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 be pretty good when we get their shields down. It's not a build I usually like, but honestly, the, the DPS might be pretty good if I can set a fire and shields on the boss and hack their shields. Once their shields are down, we're just gonna be suppressive fire. It's like a a very strange, crappy version of a Vulcan that doesn't have as much spin up time. Maybe I don't know. All right, still no store. So let's go ahead and get a weapon upgrade. Poor man's rich man's Vulcan. Kind of weird. Charge lasers are supposed to be act kind of like flax, huh? What to suppress shields or what? I don't. I don't know if I consider them similar to flax, really. Let's go and do. I should have hit his I should have hit his weapons. Uh Okay, freaking good dodges. Freaking good dodges. We'll have cloaking up for the next one. Double heavy laser 2 is kind of terrifying actually. Okay. Do the entire volley. Yes. Damn it. If I hit that, I was getting just enough dodges to keep from taking a shit ton of damage here. This is a nine power weapon system, by the way. I haven't even mentioned that. This is fucking nine power weapon system. Cheating ass slugs, by the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That is nine power weapons. Goddamn cheating slugs. Goddamn cheating slugs, man. a lot of chain lasers I picked up while you weren't looking. It's not chain, they're charge. There's a difference. There's a difference, I say. Kind of weird. Charge lasers are... Let's see. Uh, okay. Cheating ass, slug ass, ship. That's correct. 
That is correct. Uh, almost have enough of that. We do have explosive replicator to sell. Not just nine powers, nine power that's well synced. God, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven weapon power. This is uh, this is the intruders on board thing. Um, do I want to counter so I don't lose my clone bay? No, I need my clone bay. I counter this. I vent them out. They're up here. Do this. This stupid event. Fuck. Oh wait, that got them out. Okay, that's actually good. Okay, that locks them into the vented room now. No cloaking at least on these guys. I guess that's the one good thing. Nice fire. All right. Uh, I was going to say, we crew kill these guys, but crew killing does nothing against this event, actually. Crew killing does actually nothing. It's a high reward either way, I think. Holy crap, that was a frickin' frickin' frackin' frickin' frickin' ton of dodges. Fix that. 63 scrap, okay. And these slugs with their cheating ships, fake stores, free borders, and ugly crew. Agreed! Agreed on all counts. Although ugly crew, that's just kind of rude. <laughs> they're just slugs. You know, they're trying their best. It's not their fault they've got slug faces. Alright, now we can start fire beaming some slugs. How about that? Let's fire meme some slugs, potentially. Give them a taste of their own sluggy medicine. Uh, this is this one could make it so you don't take a fight. We want uh, the, we want the fight. So all right, time for some fire beam shenanigans. Shenaniganery. That uh, looks like a really high level heal day. I'm probably about to do far too much damage to actually crew kill him. We'll try though, we'll see. Okay, might be able to do it. With mind control in conjunction with all the fires, might work. Might have been there to burn. You shall burn! Oh, you're burning too much though. If I just wait it out, this might work. Okay, good. I control you guys. Yep. Wait for the O2. Or... Uh, three shots. And then follow him with that. Got him. Nice double reward. Beautiful. We didn't start the fire. Yes, you did. You started many, many fires, and then people died. That's called war crimes. But it's always been burning since the world's been turning. No, just since you started. It's only been burning since you started it. How many jumps can I get here? Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Okay. So. Can't get like every jump in the sector. Gonna hack my doors. Okay, that's kind of fine. We cloak the bomb. I'll hack this because I think we should be able to do that. Hmm, I didn't get the fire to heal me like I meant to. Oh well. Dodge. Okay. 
It's hard to crew kill when I can't see another ship know how many crew they got left. Okay, they are hanging out down here somewhere. Burning down slugs in their own sector. Not the easiest. Strategy when I don't have a slug to see where they actually are. There we go. Did that work? You get him? Got him! Alright! Blind fire slug killing. They weren't people, they were slugs. Only humans and NGs get Federation citizenship, citizenship and call, are called people. Okay, alright. Good thing we're not racist around here or anything. Escargo, who ordered it? Yes. Alright, there's a flak. <laughs> there's my... I could have had four charge lasers, chat. Could have had four. Um... Do I want flak, I guess, is the question. Of course I do, but... Is it actually better with what I have here? Hmm. Because flak is two power for three shots. Charge two is three power for four shots. This is better than chain laser. Could have. You think I'm you think I meant I'm going to have three chain lasers. Hmm. Black plus chain is better. It becomes faster. My plan is to go fire beam double charge two phase one. And then phase two and three we go double charge two and I was gonna go chain laser. I think I go flak instead of chain laser. Black plus chain is better than charge. I don't know about that. This is going to be really good for crew killing phase one. Although fire beam by itself is going to do so much crew killing. So fire chain flak is six power. So I wouldn't be able to use this with it. It's just awkward. I don't have another good two power weapon unless I go double fire weapons. Feels a little side grady. If there's another store over here, I might make other changes, but for now, I'll go with this. How many jumps do I have? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We might even get one more. Someone enlighten me why it's starting fires on enemy ship was a war crime, but blowing them to bits with regular guns is not. I mean, why in re in our real world is aren't war crimes things like using chemical warfare is not a war crime but just shooting each other is I, I don't know I don't know the rules why is it worse to do one and not the other I don't know Maybe because one you do against civilians and one you're doing against soldiers? I don't know. Certain things are considered unnecessarily cruel. But killing's fine. I don't, I don't. We're stupid humans. We make up stupid rules. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why one's worse than the other. This is looking kind of useless. Uh, I probably need to hack shields if I want to actually do something with this fire beam. Why isn't going to war a war crime? Because big nations want other people's stuff, I guess. Which is just is sounding very political, so I probably should stop even commenting about this, honestly. You get hacked on shields, it's just not working. Man, I can't hack you. Can't whatever you will you. Oh, I think our fire is finally starting to do something. Uh killing is fine, roast people is gratuitous, although delicious. Hmm. You sound like a mantis, and I approve this message. Wars of aggression are war crimes. Okay, I don't actually know what official war crimes are. <laughs> I only know what 
FTL war crimes are, which is basically everything you do in FTL. Right, I think there's a crew kill here somewhere. I just don't know where their crew are hanging out. Maybe in engines is where they're hanging out. Yeah. It is a war crime if you started. What? If you start the war? Normal weapons can start fires anyway, huh? All right. There's our other store. Do we get anything that makes us want to get rid of charged laser two? Heavy laser one is probably technically a downgrade, but I like it better. <laughs> um, and I might actually buy a slug here. He doesn't have piloting training. We'll just buy him because he's cheap crew. Have slug on sensors. Best crew. We were talking about real life war crimes, yes. That's what I was talking about anyway. Um, so if I get rid of one charge two, I can have charge two, heavy, flak one, fire beam, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes. So I think I like that better. And we'll just keep using the fire beam, I guess. Even on the later phases. We go like this. Go like this. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's not even a dive. Very nice. Do I care about anything else? Or I could buy extra crew, but let's just get upgrades now. Shield charge booster. I got cloaking hacking mind control. I don't feel like I really need anything else. So let's just get power and value points. Oh, I need one more engine, actually. What side you're on also plays a big role in determining if a particular action counts as a war crime or not. Yeah, that's true. If you uh, if you're the winning side, what is that saying? Um, history books are written by the victors. That famous saying that I've read in so many books and stuff. micro all at the same time. My controlled right as his glade beam went through. Christ almighty, that was... That was... That was really good play by him. It's almost like he wasn't an AI and tamed his weapons perfectly. Okay, this and this. Alright, now it's just value points. History is written by those who were not hanged, yes, or the winners. If history books are written by the winners, then why did the pro... Uh, I don't think I want to get into it. I'm not going to say any more about that. I knew it. I knew it. As soon as I read anything or said anything about war crimes, is we're going to start getting the things I don't actually want to say out loud, because... <laughs> anything political or even slightly... I don't know. I just... I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go any further. Today I learned only people named Victor wrote military books. It sounds about right. Only people named Victor. What's your vector, Victor? Right Roger, Roger. Go, we could probably crew kill this. Happy fire beam day. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm just not even going to read any more that have to do with who writes the victor or who writes the books and whose narrative is whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Non-political stream. And somehow I always say something that... Start pulling into... Something that is political. <laughs> An accident. I didn't mean to do it. A small bomb. My control and fire beam will make this crew murdering machine. Yes, this is a crew murdering machine, that's for sure. Uh, as a historian, you hate the history books are written by the winner's line. Oh, okay. So that's the reason why you don't like that. Gotcha. Well, when I quote that, I'm quoting not a lot of real life stuff. I read sci-fi fantasy books all the time, and 
Writers in sci-fi fantasy love to say that, so, you know. Probably is not, it's overly reductive is what you said. There you go. Uh, would you like payment? That's what we wanted, a ship fight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine weapon power again, okay. I got a free breach too, would I use it? Ah, uh, I mean, I have a fire beam. I don't think I need to crew kill with that. So probably not, is the answer to that question. It's cool, it's cool. We're all cool. It's cool, it's cool, everybody. We're cool. No politics in here. Uh, we have clearance, Clarence. What's your Victor, Vector? Vector, Victor. All right. Look at all the panicking slugmans. That's right. Because of war crimes. The best type of crimes. Wait, no, war crimes are bad again. I I'm sorry, I'm a human. I keep getting mixed up about what's good and bad. War crimes good, war crimes bad? Can't remember. I'm in FTL, so war crimes good. Outside of FTL, war crimes bad. Gotta keep that straight, you know? Okay, he did repair his weapons. I control these guys. Um, okay, good. Damn, I think I've done too much damage. Chase this guy down and start fires where he lives. I think the ship burns down before we crew kill it now. Damn. Trying to follow him to where he would try to go. Got him! No! <laughs> Crew was dead, but burned down before Clone Bay believing he was dead happened. All right. All right. As soon as I end the stream, I'm running to my office to complain about the parking. So, probably do nothing, but I feel like if I don't, I'm going to wish I had. So I need to put on record, parking sucks, you cost me $300. I would like to be on record saying you need to fix your parking. Uh, do I ever use this? No. Uh, there's my, I could have had five charge twos. Wow, amazing. You want to burst one instead of fire beam after phase one? Meh. Meh, this all seems side ready. Damn. All right, I gotta dive there, but we do get our drone parts. Shield value, sensor value, mind control value. War crimes you tolerate, bad grammar, forget about it. Not allowed, huh? Last value point, but I could have got fourth shield. Eh, the cloaking hacking, I often feel like oh, fourth shield is not that needed. Okay, friends. Okay, let's hope I don't go into a fight with these other crew on me. Do I jump now or do I finish off these guys? My hacking's not up yet. Let's just jump now. All right, empty jump. I can finish off the boarding. Okay. <laughs> wow, it's gonna take him a while to get over. Uh, take him a while to get over here, isn't it? Well, 
them word crimes. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's... Sure! What a great deal. What a great deal. Oh my god, that was... Three empty jumps and then taking over a jump. And then he takes this over as I get here. I was gonna wait for him. Jesus. Uh, I guess I could just follow him then. Yeah, actually, let's do that. Let's go to him, and if we get a bad hack, we can jump away. So I want to do it this way. Is that what I want to do? Yeah, we got a bad hack. We follow him wherever he goes. So the plan is to crew kill phase one. Um, hack shields. Wow, I did not get any extra scrap with all that. That sucks. All right. Don't hack my weapons, don't hack my weapons. Man, we got shields last time and engine and piloting this time. We got basically the second and third worst these last two runs. Not ideal. Not ideal. I need to wait a little bit for the fire beam to be ready. Oh, oh, fucking damn it, game. game! What the actual Come fuck? On. Okay, now he goes cloak there, stealth, whatever. No dodges because of hacking or yeah, piloting hack. Okay, cloak up for the next thing. Good. More fires. Oh man, so many good crew kills here. Let him in the fire. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh well. Still good crew kills. Missile stays down. Um, is anybody trying to go in there? Yes. Mind control you. Come on. Okay. I'm taking a little extra damage, kind of on purpose. If I kill this guy, the guy in the missile room, if he dies... Okay, if I kill him while he's inside room bug, that's that's GG. That's all the crew we need to kill. Yeah, cool. Finish it. Perfect. Took three damage to get perfect number of crew kills. He will not board with anybody now, and we will can counter mind control. Ideal phase one. So we can now swap fire beam over here and just kill as quickly as possible now. Good phase one. Triple dodge Dion. Well, I think we cloaked one of them. So good phase one. Good phase one. Now we do got to deal with boarding drone. Can I upgrade my O2 or my heal? Uh, my power for O2. No, so I don't really have great anti-boarding drone. So we hope he goes in one of these four-person rooms so we can move these three guys in there. It's the worst part of this, but we don't cloak first missile. We do cloak. Drone control phase, hopefully dot 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 profit. Okay, not ideal, but missiles are down. Dolphin put that. Look this now. Beautiful. Can set some fires here. We want to not actually kill his crew, so we leave that open so he can run. Oh, just don't die in the side room, bug. Okay, good. He died in that room, which means he'll be alive for final phase. Perfect. Perfect. All right, let's get you guys refreshed because we don't care about your training. That was a, I think, flawless phase two. I think we took zero damage there. It's very good. Everything's coming up, Rand House. <laughs> That's right. Okay. 52 scrap gets us. I can actually get something. Uh, I guess piloting staying up. 
if it gets missiled is the best upgrade here so our dodges don't get screwed okay let's finish it brand house kick to the face that's right Cannot cloak first missile. Have these guys ready to go repair stuff. These fucking dodges. Good job, Neo. Triple dodge. Nice. We're through. Perfect. All right, we do take this next missile though. Maybe should have delayed a little bit. Freaking Neo over here. Freaking Neo. Oh, he had my weapons right as my fire beam was ready to go off. Fuck you, FTL. All right, we have cloaking up here for this. Uh, no, no, it's actually. Ooh, this could hurt. What the hell? Stop hitting my fucking weapons, for the love of God. Right, not an ideal phase three, honestly. Doge. I messed that time. No, you need to be a good and doge. I accidentally killed you need to stop being a bad doge. Okay. All right, it's fine. It's fine. It's GG. All right. Good crystal, uh, crystal Roxy run. That should be five in a row, I think. A win is a win. A win is a win. I would rather get a not optimal phase three, but a pretty, but a per, but a great phase one and a perfect phase two when I have all the systems. So uh, that was Roxy. So that's a two win day. When my day started out with me finding out my car was towed and having to spend an hour and 300 and something bucks to go take care of that. I'll take two good wins in FTL. Let's check that score. 55-11, not bad. Not bad. Pro streamer is pro streamer. Please live stream your office four times later. Um, think about it. <laughs> Flagship impounded. Now the rebels need to pay you to get it back. That's right. But I am going to run so I can go to the office and submit a formal complaint about their terrible parking. Uh, but before they do that, I'm going to say thank you all for all the support. The uh, amazing gifted subs, $100 bomb from I think it was T-Bone Jenks earlier. Like... You all are amazing. Even when I have a rough day, you all help me feel better because that makes it feel like what I'm doing is worthwhile and appreciated, and you all are amazing. So thank you for bits. Thank you for bits. Follow subs. Give subs. We're hanging out. Tomorrow will be war, World of War Crimes. I mean, World of Warcraft. Thursday, we'll do more uh, FTL Harbor, no pause. And then, of course, World of Warcraft on Friday. So you all enjoy your own war crimes. And until next time, peace out. Happy gaming. I'll see you all later and enjoy this sea shanty. Y'all rock. Have a great night. Later, my friends.